With that, let's get started. Of course, I have to clear my throat immediately. All right, so we're, we're doing more Sekiro today. Um, I was getting my ass kicked yesterday, and I, I went and I looked it up. I looked on the, the wiki, um, and what the wiki says for Kuro's Charm is, um, if you leave it behind, you're completely changing the play style from... Uh, like one where you can block some attacks and deflect others to one where you want to deflect every attack perfectly. Uh, and I was like, yeah, that feels right. That that seems like what I had to do <laughs> um, to win. So that was that was pretty rough, but um, I don't remember why we were here. I think I was talking to that merchant over there. I think what we want to do to start today is go back to the Hirata estate. Um, Cause there's some good stuff to do uh, there now. Cause we, we defeated Genichiro. I guess I want to go get rid of Lady Butterfly next, um, but I anticipate this is going to be pretty goddamn hard, um, considering how bad Genny was. Um, I'm just going to run past all these guys, though. You guys do your thing. Um, I'm trying to think if there are more, like, prayer beads in this area that I haven't gotten. I think there's at least one. Maybe a few more, actually. This is a good place to be. Um, <laughs> that guy had no idea. Pretty sure there's like an eavesdrop that I can do. Is it gonna work? Oh, yeah, I guess I did technically eavesdrop it. Even though I'm like being the least sneaky guy. Let's see. So muffled. Uh, I have no idea what she's. Sure, she gave me some poison antidotes. That's useful against the drunkard, who will fight uh, pretty soon. So that's cool. Is there anything else in this little area? You, another NPC. Yes. What good are you? Tell me you didn't leave a tiny in there. Yes, I hope. Huh. Fun. We get blamed for something that I, I genuinely don't think is our fault. Uh, 
I wonder if they're talking about me. Uh, they might be talking about um, Owl, actually. Our, our character's dad. Turns out he's he's a bad guy. Um, but that's not really surprising, ultimately. Do I talk to you as well? Are you the bandit guy? Hey, good sir. Good sir, are you? Well, in any case... Yeah, this is the, there, the huh? merchant that we were actually just talking with uh, at the end of last stream. Oh, by the way, while I was on my way here, I saw it was, uh, I bet there's, that's what I Yeah, there's some kind of treasure in that pagoda, huh? Hey, while I was on my it was, I Yeah, okay, sure. Um... Yes, yeah, so I think we can get the spear, uh, Shinobi prosthetic from here, which is pretty cool. Um... Oh, nice. Those are actually really good to have for tough boss fights. Although, once you use it, it is gone. And there are very few of them in the game. Um, but it just gives you another res, which is kind of crazy. Um, is there anything else to do? I mean, I guess this little area still has some, some lads chilling. Yeah, I forgot. I, I unlocked a ninjutsu thing. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, it's just the one that puts you back in stealth. So you can use that to, um... To, like, backstab one enemy in a crowd and then kind of get away and stab others. It's pretty cool. It uses, like, a lot of spirit emblems, if I remember correctly. Oh, there's chickens in here. Always happy to see more pellets. I, I, when I was reading the wiki, I also actually found out that there's a pretty big bonus for um, getting rid of the Kuros charm too. You get way more experience, like 30% more experience or something, um, and Sen. So that's like huge. Um, I don't want to have to just kill all the chickens. Any other items in here that are worth getting? This place has been run just completely overrun by chickens <laughs> i was gonna say run over by chickens that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense but i guess i get what i was going for oh and i still haven't got the axe have i wait a second did i actually hang on did i pick that up and then just never affix it to the prosthetic how do i know Grade materials, prosthetic arm, tools. Okay, I still have never opened the skills menu. That's funny. Um, I feel like I got the axe. It's in this area, isn't it? Like back here somewhere? If I missed it, this is definitely where to get it. So I should keep looking. I remember it being like right around here. Great. Okay, there's a lot of enemies in this little zone, so... Was it not just, like, right here? This was the fire... the flame vent or whatever, right? Oh, shit. Maybe it is further up ahead? Oops. I might just look up where it is so that I don't waste like the entire stream running around looking for something that's like not at all where I'm looking. I should get out of a combat area first. I don't think anybody can see me to shoot at me from here. Okay. One second. Oh, you're throwing, like, clay shards at me? That's fine. Um...
There's two guards that I can eavesdrop about their plan to do... Uh, it's, it's on this path somewhere. Maybe it's up ahead from here, I don't know. Makes sense. Yeah, you can go down in the water. Or... And fight this very tough spear enemy who has a lot of friends. Like archers and shit. In fact, I'm quite sure that what I want to do is kill all these guys and then acquire stealth. This is fine. This is less fine. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> this terrain is like kind of annoying to isolate these enemies on. Oh god. What? Yes, I, I wanted to hug the wall. How did you know, game? How indeed did you know? Okay. All right. I've kind of got them isolated. Hopefully that guy will stay stuck over there. No, nope, he didn't. Of course not. Okay, can I just shuriken you to death? Not really. Oh, perfect. Okay, now we fuck off. Maybe we go backstab these other guys now. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Oh, no. Okay, they saw me. It's fine. Let's go up here. No sweat. Is there stuff to do over this way, too? Oh, this is the, the water path. Yeah, there's, there's like a couple things to do from here. Um... I wonder if you can get over there from here. I don't think you can. I think that's meant to be like a only go in one direction kind of a thing. Um, okay, let's... Where, where did he go? The spearman. I remember this being a very tough fight the first time I tried, and now it's going to be even harder. Okay, so he is facing the other direction. How many of the stealth sugars do I have? Just just to guarantee it. Oh, what? He suddenly started walking. Is there just an item back there that I didn't pick up? No, it was it was a lamp. You're, uh, looking in kind of an inconvenient place, aren't you? Hello, buddy. There we go. Now, I have got much better at using the Makiri counter since... Okay, I thought. I have to time it a little better. There we go, too. Oh, you have sweeps too, huh? Wow, that guy... I owned him! That was... that was ridiculous. I was expecting that to be, like, way harder. So there is a prayer bead for sale as well. We need to remember that and from one of the merchants. So, once I get one more... Oh, you know what I should do, too? There's a, an idol right here. Um, we have five skill points. You know what that means? We get health on kill, which is very, very good. Actually works mid boss fight too when you get the death blows in the middle of the boss fight. So let's let's get that. Um, I'm trying to think about what I want to unlock next. This might be really good. Increases posture damage on deflecting. That's like kind of a staple thing in this game, I guess. Um, yeah. So. If we go up that path, I think there's a key that we need. So we should do it. This archer guy shouldn't be hard.
Oh, I got lucky that didn't hit me there. The, the projectiles do like double or triple damage midair. It's kind of crazy. That's probably what just was, isn't it? Maybe not. These guys are pretty clueless. Heal on kill is actually huge because you have very limited healing resources in this game. Shit. Oh, and I'm on fire. That's cool. Okay, let's use that dousing powder actually. I only have five though, so I need to be careful. I don't know why I thought I was going to backstab that guy like it was Dark Souls 1. <laughs> I'm just circling straight like a maniac. Oh my god, both of those arrows just went right through me. Gotta love those death blow iframes, huh? Hey, you. Quit shooting me. That big guy is really tough, and I kind of don't want to fight him head on, so I'm not going to. I'm pretty sure I can just... Oh, completely screw it up. It's fine. I'm quite sure there's a way to get back up there. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, we, we gotta get this key so that we can get to... Somebody see me. Since when were you there? kill you. Yeah, I really don't want to fight you head on, so I'm just going to run right past. I don't need any of that. I like that this game kind of encourages being a coward sometimes. Um, is there an enemy in here yet? Just this Anna, asshole. Uh, it's you. I'm afraid I made a bit of a blunder. Perhaps the years have finally caught up with me. Ah, no bother tending to my wounds, no point. Mm. It's too late. Well, this is an act, isn't it? Wolf, you must. This is. The key to the seal find. Going through the front is not an option. Yes, sir. Yes. I don't remember what Owl's goals are, but I do know he sucks. Understood. Wolf. Yes. The best wolf. Father. Cool. Now there's just way more fire. Fun. How do I get out of here now? Remember. may not be the right way. Yeah, I don't think it is. Shit. Yep, okay, well that's just death that way. Oops. I'll jump right in the fire. That's a good idea. I, you know what I want to do? I'm going to get on stream, and then I'm going to jump right in the fire. <laughs> Unseen aid? Hell yeah. Okay. I appreciate that. I had like 600 sen. I had cleared out a lot of these guys, though, so that I'm not super happy about. I got the key, though. Do I even need to go back up there? I know there's, a, like, another guy, like a, a mini-boss that you can fight up here, but I don't know if that happens later or now. I'm just gonna run past all this nonsense one more time. Oh, God. Where's this bowman running to? Oh. He ran past me for a second. Like, what are you doing, guy? Wait, so the door got engulfed in flames before, but now it's fine? Huh? Oh, he tells me what to do. I'm stupid. Head to my left and follow the cliff. If I go through the cemetery, there will be a path to the universe. Leave it to me. Head to my left. 
Oh, huh? oh the cliff. I think that. Oh god. Oh god. I almost did the same thing again. Probably just means this, right? Oh, is this also death? I don't know if this was the side of that water that I wanted to be on, but. Pretty sure there's stuff to do here anyway, so. This is the pagoda that has good stuff in it. No, I don't think so. Hopefully your friends didn't hear that. Are these the really tough enemies down this way? There's like two spear guys. Hmm, yep. Okay, well... I should probably go clear the other enemies first, to be honest. Okay, well they eavesdrop, so I should let them reset. Oh, maybe... maybe kill the bowman, though. <laughs> you serve no purpose but to be annoying. Okay. Very good. I'm gonna let you guys reset. They can't see me from here, right? There still is combat music, so maybe I have to go down here. Is there anything else in this water I can check while I'm here? Wait, this was this. Bridge. I remember that. I think I was actually probably supposed to go in the water on the other side of that waterfall, so oops. Um, but no worries, I wanted to explore this uh, as well anyway, so. Oh! Okay. They're gonna walk back to their positions and then I can eavesdrop them. I saw that corpse in the background, just like the physics reset on it. Oh, you don't see me. Can I eavesdrop? Am I too far? The audio is so quiet, it's like... I bet you're staying fine. Totally under control by now. Yeah. If anyone's gonna get out, they're only don't blood a single rat. I know. I don't mind at all. That dialogue is so funny, man. If I wanted to escape, this would be where I would do it. Why did it not have the check? Okay, now it does. That took you a long time to notice, bud. Okay. Ah. I knew there was a bastard enemy sitting around a corner. There always is. Yeah, so this is the way up to the next thing. Um, I don't really want to do that yet. I want to go get the axe, which is past these really fucking hard spear enemies. So I think there's a cheesy way to kill them, too. You can lure them up this path and then reset stealth, and then they'll walk back down the path. Come on, bud. Come this way. Come on. Shit. Wrong button. So delayed. Which means the more you're just good at the game. Uh, no, I, I know I'm... I'm not, but it is set really satisfying to hit those Makiris, I'll tell you what. There's another one, isn't there? Yeah. Where's your friend? Uh-oh. Okay, that one's not as slow. Oops. 
doing great fighting your friend. Oh, I don't know why that didn't Makiri, but it's fine. We got him. Those guys were like so unbelievably hard my first time. It must have taken me 10 tries. Bulging coin purse. Hell yeah. I think that's like a thousand sen or something. Oh my god, and I have a thousand on me as well. I should really go spend it somewhere. Aren't these guys guarding the... Axe thing? Uh, am I, was I completely reading the wiki wrong? It's very, very, very possible. Hang on. From the path after coining the flame barely cars. Dying man, take the noise. It is possible that I just, like, missed it earlier. I don't know. <laughs> um, but because of what he said about fire, I think it might be earlier in the level than this. So, let's go back over here. I feel like you're supposed to find the axe before you find these two guys with the shields. So I'm a little confused. Because it is really just the way to get those guys is just use the axe. Maybe these are the guys that I have to kill? It says kill the guards and open the door. Oh god. I would like to not die. I'm carrying kind of a lot of money. So that was... Hmm. All right. That was chickens, right? Oh, it's these guys. Oops, they've seen me. Okay, it's fine. Just open the door. Take the item. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, I got the axe. And now we should just go back, I guess. But I, I think the easiest way to do that, actually, since I haven't rested, is just keep going up the path and go to the next sculptor's idol. So that is what we will do. I know there is the three-tiered pagoda thing, and I think I know how to get to that too, so I can do that uh, after. Which is, I think, the spear, which we actually like very much want. So yeah, let's go up the cave. One of the things that always struck me about this game is that there isn't really a, like, lantern or a need for one, because they're like, yeah, canonically, Wolf just has really good eyesight. And because he's a shinobi, he can just see in the dark. And it's like, okay, yeah, sure. Take away an annoying darkness mechanic that makes it so that I can't see shit. <laughs> I'm okay with it. Yeah, I keep doing that. I'm, like, waving my hand around off camera, like, you can't see it. It's fine. Um... I only have one prayer bead? I thought I had two. Um, this is the guy that has the prayer bead, I think. So we'll just go buy it from him. Why not? And I think we do get to go back to Hirata Estate later as well, which is pretty cool. I like yeah, that. I would like to purchase an offering. I don't have enough. I need 400. Okay. May the departed. Uh, 400. I should probably just use one of these, huh? This is 500, right? Yeah. yeah okay, and then how many pellets can I get? One pellet. Well, that's fine. May the depart. Uh, can I get any skills while we're here? 
are worth getting. Mid-air deflection actually seems good. That seems worth doing. Um, I also want that, though. We'll get mid-air deflection first. Um, and then back to the Harada Estate to look for the three-tier pagoda, I guess? I think this is where I want to go for this. I could be wrong. It's been known to happen. This is a, a cool looking section though. So yeah, that's the waterfall that we were on like the other side of. I think we want to go this way. Remember this being a path. Oh, there's treasure carp here too. Look, treasure carp. This is just that, huh? Contact medicine? Isn't that the thing that just kills you? Uh, hang on, I, I want to look at that. Contact medicine. Oh yeah, see, so it's like... Is it literally just like a pile of hornets? I, I can't remember. There's a way to like view the image. I think it is. It's just a big pile of hornets. And um... Yeah, you, you just give yourself, like, a weak poison so that strong poison doesn't affect you. It's pretty funny, in general. I really thought it was over here. I guess not? Yeah, I was, I was really surprised I didn't die when I jumped into the water over there. I don't remember how to get to this pagoda. Maybe it is further back down the path. There we go. Actually, I seem to remember being able to access it from here. the way to access it from here? This guy's just doing itchy mungy on top of the roof. That's not what I wanted at all. I think it's that path over there, but there's no like way to grapple to it, is there? Ah! That felt really close. I- that doesn't- that can't be the right way to go, is it? I'll give it one more solid try. But that really doesn't feel right. Hmm. It really looks like a thing you're supposed to do from the other side. I, I got way closer the first time I tried that, too. I was literally there. I just didn't like slash through the bamboo. That's funny. Okay. That's what I thought. I had to just check really quick. I was like, I, I feel like it's really close to here. I just don't know exactly where. And yeah. Oh wait, this is the wrong way. Just swam completely in the wrong direction. It's fine. Bamboo thicket slope. This is where, oh yeah, I need to go further up now. I'm like all confused 
actually. This is not where I thought I was. Yeah, I need to be on the other side of that. Okay, hang on. It is really weird that you can do this in the water. Um, one of the slowest homeward bone animations in any of these games. <laughs> is, is you really can't do it uh, if there's any enemies that like know where you are because you're stuck for like ever. <laughs> um, yeah, so that I I like picked up the item right next to it, but there's just bamboo that you gotta slash that I just I didn't do, so I forgot. It's pretty subtle of a secret as well, so I can't really blame myself for that. Too bad. Yeah, I was literally right here. Okay, it's not that subtle. I should have remembered. It's fine. This gives us the Mist Raven, I, I think, which is actually like a prosthetic that I, I never use. Like, literally ever. I think it's pretty good. And you can just like completely dodge attacks. Who's seen me? Oh, it's one of you. Oh no. Do you have more than one health bar? I really hope not. your leg every time. I never rematched this uh, other guy yesterday. There was one of these guys that I was fighting. I should go and do that. No. I'm getting better at fighting that guy. There's a few more of them that we're gonna see. Yeah, but there's the Mist Raven feathers too. I guess I, I never equipped the axe, but that's okay. Road of Extraordinary Foe? I see, I see, I see. I don't think there's anything else to do around here, is there? That seems like death, fall distance. So I don't want to do that. I would put an item behind the building too, but I am not every game dev, that's for sure. Okay, I guess let's go back down in the water. It should be pretty easy to get back to the idol, or at least faster to do this, than to use the um, little statue, Homeward bone, Boneward statue. What is it actually called? Homeward idol. Sure. Uh, and we'll go back up the path and we're going to go fight Juzu, the drunkard. This guy's not too bad if you actually like pay attention to his timings and try to deflect. I remember just like circle strafing him forever on my first playthrough, which is definitely not the way to do it. Um, I seem to remember there being some decently tough enemies like right around this corner. Oh no, not yet. I think that's when you come back to this area that, that happens. For now, this is not too bad. I know there's some items in this building that I'm underneath, but... Is there something up here, too? I guess not. Okay, let's clear the building for items. Just smash the place up, who cares? There isn't, like, a secret wall here, huh?
Oh, divine confetti is very nice to find. I think that's a limited resource in this game, and it is very strong as well. Okay. Give me that item dowsing powder, thank you. Is that everything? I think so. Okay, um... There's a, a guy that we can recruit to help us go fight. But first, I would like to clear out some of the goons. So there's a whole load of enemies in this area. This is going to take a second. Oh, I guess I should have attached the axe, huh? Before I came into this encounter. It's okay. I should have gone for the archer first. You. Oh, there are so many of them. Come on, guys. Come over here. Oh, the boss is coming. I like how he poisons you just because he drinks so much alcohol and then pukes on his blade. It's like... Brilliant game design from software, thank you. You guys are geniuses. Oh, it's just that shield guy over there. Don't set me on fire, it's very rude. Hello. Terrain that functions well? Oh god. Yep, and now I'm on fire. Okay. Okay, everything is fine. Oh, that must have been a huge pile of dowsing powder that we found, actually. Fuck, that's the boss. Okay, boss, hello. I'll kill this guy first. Okay, great. I think the setup is done. No, there's one more dipshit. I really want to backstab you, don't I? You're annoying as fuck to fight without the axe. Yep. Okay, well, that's fine. Don't you run in, Mr. NPC. I'm just gonna reestablish stealth real quick. Maybe go fight some of these guys in the other side of the map. Just for fun. Slash to get shot at with more fire arrows. Damn it. Combat music, which is good. Is the NPC still sitting there? Yes, he is. Good. Okay. So if I leave the goons just sitting there, pretty sure the boss, um, or the our friendly NPC will um just go and fight them instead of helping me with the boss is not what I want. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Now we go and get the NPC. We took this from an incredibly unfair fight to one that is kind of unfair in our favor. Oh god, he spat on me. No, no, don't 
grab. Thank you. I had so much trouble with this encounter on the first try. Oh, goddamn. I was gonna say, it feels nice to be dealing with him pretty handedly here. <laughs> the shuriken! Just to, to top that one off. Very nice. Connoisseur of Buenos. Thank you for the GG. I appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying the stream so far. We're having a good time. Uh, I am kind of scared of the Lady Butterfly flight. <laughs> flight? The Lady Butterfly fight that is to come. Oh god. I thought it was all clever changing my targets over and over. Nope, I just confused my own brain. It's quite easy to do. Confuse my brain. There's not much in there, to be frank. Very nice. I think there's like a pretty decent thing in here, isn't there? Lady Butterfly, yeah, it's gonna be something. Um, Genny was, was rough. I, I did not like fighting Genny uh, without the charm, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I knew there was something else in here. Um, but I did, like, basically flawless the Tomoe phase. Oh, sick. Four prayer beads. Hell yeah. So at least I get more health before I go fight Lady Butterfly. But if if I just get completely owned... Um, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. One closer to affiliate. Um... Yeah, if I just get completely owned, there's, like, a bunch of other stuff we could do. We could go fight Snake Eyes or whatever. Um... Yeah, let's make our deflects better. Because without the charm, basically just means deflect everything. And next, I think I probably want better Makiri. Um, although both of these are good. Um, actually, reducing the posture that I take should probably be my priority, because you take so much posture damage without the charm. It's nasty, actually. And I have, I have 700 Sen again, too. Uh, okay, yeah, let's get more health. Um, yeah, the, the, the shurikens are, are fucked. Uh, especially in, in the second phase, right? They just hit you no matter what. Um, let's go affix all these um, prosthetic tools that I've got now. I, I got access to like a whole bunch of them. Um, I don't remember where the spear is. I feel like... Oh, no, you know what? I do know where that is. There's a whole bunch of stuff I could do if I don't want to fight Lady Butterfly right now, actually. Um, but you know what? I, I feel like I'm in a unique position to do well against Lady Butterfly. A mechanical... Me it's a mechanism that ended here. Um, because I've been doing the boss rush. With the verse, I can use very purifying, um, purifying agents. So if you find something... Like sure. Um... Fit new prosthetic tool. It's so weird, you stand up and like nod, and then yeah, I had four that I hadn't done. Boom, boom, do it all. Oh yeah. Huh, I forgot that was a thing. Um, present Shinobi prosthetic upgrade. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I should probably just do both of these, huh? I need 400 cent, of course I'm at 294. Um, okay. Um, let's give him some sake, why not? I brought some sake. Don't mind if I do. I think you can give Emma, the sculptor, and Ishin all sake. They have like different dialogue. Oops, I skipped one. But it does make my old wounds ache. Your left arm? Yes. <laughs> of the man who was Lord Ishin. Ishin. <laughs> of course. I was on the verge of being consumed. Consumed. Shura. But you do Yeah, this well is all lore to explain the um, demon of hatred, right? Avoid additional if hardships. No thanks. I like more hardship. Um... Put the axe on. I think the Sabimaru is actually pretty good. I just never use it. Um, 
Oh, look who's here. You have like a gourd right. seed, don't you? That's right. In that case, that is surely a shinobi. Yeah, you do have a gourd seed. I've done both of these things. I got the Sabumaru and did, did the three-story pagoda, so... None of that is very useful for me, but I will buy the gourd seed, because, um... Hell yeah. I probably want to use that. And then... This is going to be, like, most of my... Money, but that's fine. Oh, right. Uh, <laughs> okay. I'm just going to go on a quick field trip to get six sen. Surely there's an enemy that'll give me, like, five. And then I'll have to kill one more, but it's... You know what? It, it would normally be five, and then with a 20% bonus... Uh, from the additional hardship, sell a fistful of ash. That's actually a good idea. I never use those. I, f I always forget you can sell that stuff. Okay, 14 sen. There we go. Um, can I get back, though? Oh, shit. Yeah, well, yes, I just missed the <laughs> grapple. <laughs> uh, okay. Give me that gourd seed. And then there's actually a shortcut from here to um, hey there, the top of Ashina Castle, which just... It it makes sense, I guess. No, it doesn't. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I totally should have sold a fistful of ash. That would have been the smart thing to do. Until next, Until next time. Let's also... I want to look at the skill tree. Because we just got this one. Um... I feel like there is really good stuff in here. Like, these latent effects are really good. Um, okay. Yeah, let's let's do the weird shortcut thing. It's back here, right? I never got that coin purse, really. Okay, I don't think it is actually behind the... It's, like, tucked away in a weird spot. Yeah, it's this cave. Okay. I kind of don't like how it makes you put your sword away so that you can't hit the NPCs or whatever. Eh, fuck off, who cares? Let me hit the NPCs. I want to be able to make that mistake. It would be funny if that happened on stream. If you, like, hit Emma and then your so playthrough was fucked, yes. that would be hilarious. Okay, oh my god, this dialogue is so bad, and there's so much of it. Like, I love this game for the combat and stuff, but... Good God, some of some of the dialogue stuff is good Lord. Okay, you know we we will have Lady Butterfly be like a goal uh, for the stream. I want to do it before the end of the stream, but I feel like there's more useful stuff that I could do right now. Um, and most of it's actually at Ashina Reservoir. <laughs> So I think there's a spear that I can get over here. I'm not sure where the key is. I think you kill the guy that... Actually, I think I do know how to get to it. Um, it's kind of a weird path from here, but I think I know the way. I think those guys that I eavesdropped, I actually do have to kill them. Which is not usually a thing. So I think if you kill these guys, you just get a key. Yeah, look at that. Gatehouse key. I'm actually remembering things today. That's kind of a shock to the senses. But oh, I was expecting to land on the tree branch, but it's fine. It is fine. Okay. And that gives us the ability to snag the axe. Uh, so let's go do that. I remember spending a lot of time in this zone, this little area, my first playthrough, but hopefully we, we can do it a little bit smoother this time. There's the key. Oh, another fistful of ass. Very good. I mean, you can use them to, like, uh, cheese the, the corrupted monk, right? 
like the first monk, not the true monk, but the the like apparition one. Um, there's like a you like throw four of them at her in a row or something, and um, hey, I really want to be backstabbing those big fat guys. that because I think with um Kuro's charm those guys dies their posture goes in literally one um Nikiri. Alright. Oh the big fat fuck. Can I just death blow you from the grass? Oh beautiful. That could not have gone any better. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. The Armored Warrior definitely has some, some goofy shit that you can do, too. Um, those trees are looking awfully JPEG-y, aren't they? <laughs> um, yeah, I think there's like a spear guy up here. If not yet, there definitely is later. But I, I, think, I think there is already a guy to fight up here. If I remember correctly. Oh, yep, there is. And I've already fucked the um stealth so in that case let's go stab this guy and also i kind of want to try to stab the big fat hello spear sir you're doing fine you still haven't seen me good oh beautiful <laughs> it doesn't fund the trees that's funny as hell okay i should go kill the guy with the gun and then re-establish stealth. Oh, there's several gun guys. <laughs> He's just still facing the other way. What? He ran around behind me? I didn't see it. Actually, you know what would be like a really funny way to do this would be go to kill the other mini boss over here and then just come back and kick this guy's ass. But if this mini boss owns me, I don't think he will. I've got so much stronger since I fought him the last time. Yeah, we got this. This guy is not going to be a problem at all. Let me just make sure I actually get the death blow right. Very nice. Shit. That's all my posture. Live. Yeah, this guy is pretty hard. Did you get my posture again? He just keeps breaking it. I remember that was the struggle the last time, too. Hey, good at that combo, though. What? That's weird. I'm getting like a bunch of phone calls from random numbers. Very cool. Do you... God damn it, he just does not give you a chance to breathe. Fuck. I was doing good with the Makiris before, but I'm... Messing it up now. you for the gg again i appreciate it um but this is just another path now right this yeah it is where does this take me an abandoned dungeon oh right this is this we had access to this room from another angle before i think 
Where is the guy? Oh, there he is. Yeah. So there's another way to access this room, too. Um, so you don't even actually technically need to fight that guy, which is kind of funny, but... Um, yeah, how many... Eh, I have a decent amount of Sen to go and die to the spear guy, but whatever, I don't care, I'll do it. I should probably at least look at my phone and see what all these calls are. Yeah, I doubt it's anything that I care about, to be honest. Probably just scams. Um... Yeah, so now I should actually go around and try to maintain stealth to fight this guy. Feeling a little tired today, but not too bad. I'm already pretty happy with the progress that I made this stream. Oh shit, don't see me, don't see me. <laughs> that was dumb. Okay, I have one res and three pellets. Let's see if that's enough. Are there any items in here now? I think just the remnant, right? Do what must be done. Don't lie with... I don't know why you were granted that power either, little kid. But you were, so... Oh, there's an item on the roof. Let's go get that. Let's just make all the noise. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. I really do. I'm having so much fun doing this. I, um... I For a very long time, I was like, you know what? I feel like I would be really good at streaming. It's like the kind of thing that I just feel like would... I don't know, I'd just be good at it, uh, right? And then it was really hard to get myself to actually try to start doing it, because the fear of failure is, is big, right? But... Okay, I don't think I can get up there without alerting this guy to my presence, so we'll just fight him first, I guess. Pop a pellet right at the start of the fight. Oh, that's so delayed. Okay, I need to remember that. Take one more pellet. Okay. We can Makiri the second one. That's fine. Goddamn. Okay. There was no kanji for that. That was just get fucked. That was brutal. I felt that one like deep, deep inside. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there goes all my money. All my apes. How could you do this? Um, but let's go in actually with the requisite amount of heals. Seven Spears be like, yeah, these guys are, are no joke. Um, the version of him that comes later in the game when Ashina gets invaded. Those enemies, um, I remember getting stuck on the one for like a long time. Um, and there's like prayer beads gated behind that stuff. So if you want to get max health, you have to just do some of the optional content. I, I actually really like the way that most of the, I did the thing again. Uh, most of that stuff is designed um, in this game. The, the sort of health and damage and skill tree, all of it. It just, um, I don't know, the, the, the holding the square button to uh, like suck in the Sen from enemies is a little weird. But other than that, oh my god. Okay, yeah, I remember this guy was hard, but I thought he was- I just thought he was hard because I was bad. No, he's actually like a son of a bitch. Look at how much posture damage that did! I deflected that, by the way! Okay. Oh, that was obviously a sweep. What was I thinking? Okay. There we go. Oh no, not the big guy. 
Not the big guy. Please tell me he stops coming up the hill. <laughs> I really don't want to fight that guy too. Uh, shit. Okay, well. Oh, there's no way around the building. I can't get that, no. <laughs> okay, well. I guess this is just a reset. Yeah. Let's just... I need to either kill the, um... Oh. Fuck. I was saying earlier in the stream that you cannot use that if any enemies know your location. Ah. It was harrowing. <laughs> it takes so long. I should either backstab the big guy or, um... I don't know, maybe just come fight the Seven Spears guy later? But what am I gonna do then? Go fight Lady Butterfly? <laughs> I don't really wanna. You die? Okay. Doing a little better at maintaining stealth this time. Yeah, I think I am going to want to backstab just the one big guy. Just to give myself, like, a little more room. You really don't want to fight the spear guy on the stairs. You could lure seven spear into the side of the building. Oh, yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Sure. That seems like the best place to fight him anyway, because it's just flat ground. Fighting anything on stairs in this game is horrifying. Like, genuinely. Oh god, I'm just already remembering the, um, the white monkey at the bottom of, uh, the gorge. <sighs> that enemy is fucked just in general, and without Kuro's charm, I'm scared. Okay, come this way. Why does it... Oh, fuck you for the delay on that. Guardian Ape. Well, not, not Guardian Ape, but you know what I mean. The guy with the, the white monkey that's holding two swords. Obviously not talking about Guardian Ape. Oh my god. Yeah, this guy is just rude. I don't know if I would rather be fighting snake eyes, but... What the fuck? Like, I literally deflect it, and then I'm, like, knocked over, so I can't Makiri. I know you can just run past it, but... That enemy is really hard. So you can Makiri it if you just mash the button. This is going to be hard, but I'm going to keep trying this guy. I have faith. I am losing a whole lot of sand and stuff, but who cares? I know you, you can't just run past all the enemies. I mean, most of them. Yeah, the ape duo. I think I should probably go fight, this, fight the snake eyes that's um blocking the path to uh, the Mibu village or whatever. That way I don't have to fight ape duo. Uh, like, I mean, I will fight it, but I don't want to have to fight it to get to the Mibu village. Is that, is that what it's called? The, the village. Whatever the village is called. Um, where you get the breathing technique... Um, it's so funny, I see that grapple point and my brain is like, yes, I must grapple. Honestly, the grappling system is fun in this game alone. I was talking about how, like, I don't give a shit about the story, but the combat is really good. The movement is also fun. Ape Duo is funny. Uh, I don't... 
think it's gonna be fun to do without Kuro's Charm. I'm just gonna be real with you. I think that's gonna suck. Um... Recovering fast, friend. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, how did that not do so much more damage to me? Okay, heal. I'm doing okay. Oh, why'd I jump? That was dumb. Okay. Oh. I saw my life flash before my eyes. Talk. Ah! <laughs> Ocean Man, how's it going? Your your name showed up as the same color as the um, other chatter I've been talking to the stream, so I didn't see you were there. How's it going, man? AFK doing... Advertiser unfriendly activities. Well, I can't blame you. That's some of the some of the best stuff in life is advertiser unfriendly stuff, you know? Like socialism. <laughs> uh, funny joke. Uh I, I'm having a lot of fun playing this game, but I'm also just for reference, Ocean Man, this is probably the most difficult of From Software's games. And I mean you probably know from your just like brief stint into Elden Ring that those games are fucked in general. And then I was like, you know what would be fun? I'm gonna take the hardest of their games and I'm I'm just gonna do like a really horrible challenge run. That little uh, red kanji icon underneath my health bar on the bottom left indicates that um, I left this item behind that basically like I can't block attacks anymore without taking chip damage. Yeah, ah, uh, plus the demon bell is too too much for me, I think. This is even too much for me. I'm getting my ass handed to me. Um, oh, this guy's definitely doable, though. I feel like I'm, I'm getting the download. Come on. Come here, buddy. Oh, that was obviously a sweep. What was I doing? There's like a little delay after he rushes at you sometimes. Um, crack these. Oh yeah, I'm, yes, the modding scene for this game, specifically this one, they've made mods that are like way harder than the base game. That specific thrust will just kill me over and over. I'm sure of it. Cause it's like every other thrust attack in the game has a specific timing, except for that one, which delays it just enough to fuck you. Um. Yeah, I, like, the only game I can think of that has, like, a better modding scene than FromSoft stuff is, like, Skyrim. Or I guess you could even say, like, Isaac. Um, if you know anything about that, that game has tons of mods. Skyrim is, like, the OG game for mods, though, so... Yeah, people have made, like, complete reworks of this game to, like, make it way harder. Um, new bo- like, added moves to bosses and stuff. Yes, Celeste has crazy mods too, that's true. God, I- I- I should play Celeste on stream. I, I have that on the list of stuff I want to do. That game is- is pretty hard. Oh yeah, I just can't see anything because of the glare. Well... I'm glad you're here in the stream. It's nice to have you, Ocean Man. 
I appreciate it. Oh god, I pressed the wrong button. Nearly just plummeted to my death. It doesn't actually kill you falling off a cliff in this game. I mean, it can. If you, if it takes away all your health, but it doesn't by default. Hell yeah, man. Oh, see that time there was no delay. Fuck you, man. That's bullshit. They look the same. Playing ranked. Oh, please tell me you're not talking about League. Okay, even if you block that, you can still... Fuck you! I hate you! Oh, that was the one that had the, um, the delay. Ah. He's getting in my head. He's getting in my head. Uh-oh. Yeah, I never understood those games, to be honest. Like, LOL and Dota and stuff. I just, I never got it. It never made sense to me. It just, can, they confuse my brain. Um... Yeah, well, I guess I'm also in a masochistic mood. That's why I'm playing this fucking game. A lot of people, like, some of my favorite streamers quit this game partway through because they just couldn't handle it. It was pretty funny. Um, I mean, I, this is one of those games where if you take, like, a long break from it and then come back, you're just fucked. Like, good luck. Because um, it is so, like, dependent on you kind of learning the controls and... It is a hard game, yes. Who would have thought? Um, I remember the first time I played this game, when I fought Lady Butterfly, I fought her super early, and I just, like, mashed my head at the wall until I finally beat her. And I was like, that's the hardest boss I've ever fought in any game. And then I fought Owl, and I was like, that's the hardest boss I've ever fought in any game. And then I fought Owl Father, and I was like, that's the hardest boss I've ever fought by, like, a lot. And then I fought Ishin. Uh, and Ishin's a bastard. Um, okay. Let's back it up now, bud. Come on, come this way. Oh, that jump gave me iframes. What are you doing on the stairs? Come on. What? Okay, that move I need to understand. There just should be a kanji for that, and there isn't. Why did I do that? That was very unwise. Like, okay, let me, let me put it this way, um, if it's your first playthrough and you stop playing for like three weeks, you're gonna have a bad time, right? Like, if you know what you're doing and you stop for a while, who cares? Like, I, I play this game religiously probably, like, every day for, uh, like a couple months and then I, uh, maybe a month, and then I stop playing for a while, right? <laughs> but your first playthrough, say you were stuck on Guardian Ape, so you take like two two weeks break or whatever uh, which is essentially what i think grapefruit did uh when, when like he was playing this game and he, he they were supposed to go through the all the FromSoft games like he and his friend together and then his friend was like in australia when the game came out so his like he was stuck on guardian ape and then his friend like shows up to try to fight it never having touched the game at all and like they hadn't he like fruit hadn't played it in weeks and it was just like no wonder they stopped like i can't blame them but I think Jerma made it through this game, and, I mean, everybody makes fun of how bad he is at video games, so if Jerma can do it, right? Like, any of my friends who are like, oh, it's too hard. No. No, it isn't. Oh! That actually that was actual terror <laughs> in my voice. <laughs> oh, man. Um, 
when you type Keck W, I don't see it actually show up as an emote. Is there like another um, plugin that I need to install um, to my chat so that I can see more emotes? I have like better TTV. I don't know if there's another one um, as well. Yeah, that's pretty true. Like if Jeremy could do it, anyone could do it, Charmless. Exactly. And that's no, no, like, shade on Jerma. He's, he's an elder gamer, you know? It's fine. Um, and he, like, his favorite thing is, like, iPad games, too. So, like... Oh! I should have deflected that, but it was too risky. Oh, I'm playing like shit. Okay. Oh, I need to add emotes manually? Okay, yeah, that's... Once I get affiliate, I know I, I'll have, like, my own emo slots, um, but I do not have that yet. I need, like, 15 more followers or something. Fuck. Okay, maybe we don't fight this guy yet. I said I was gonna do it until I do it. Uh, it takes too long to run back to him for me to want to do this over and over. <laughs> if I just spawned in behind him and I could just go backstab him and try it every time, it would be fine. 7 TV. Oh, okay. Oh, you need to add emotes on that. I see. Browser extension. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shouldn't be too bad. I can do that uh, some other time. Let's... Where is the Snake Eyes before... Um, the Mibu Village? I think I actually go it from here. Wait, did Jerma do it with uh, the dragon doll? Seriously? That's crazy. I would I would never have guessed. I mean, this is one of those games that you can kind of bash your head against the wall and then you will eventually just get it, right? Yeah, I, I would pass away. I mean, he's already just like the best on the platform, right? Like, kind of... Nobody can really shake up to how insane Jerma is, just in general. Um, I don't know, like, so much of my sense of humor is just baked from, like, Jerma's old TF2 videos. He's this guy, he's talking about the shamisen. What's wrong? Following you, it's kind of I see. That melt. I mean, I don't, I don't think it's it's like that serious, but you know. Will you be what? If you wish to, then you over the Oh, I guess she says jump in the hole. We'll do it. Ah. There we go. Yeah, so you jump in the hole, and then there's just a grapple point. It is funny that you just have to kind of take the blind leap, though. Attack power one, charmless, and demon bell. Uh, that sounds horrible. Why would you do that? Okay, that guy is like not worth fighting. That's literally just deflect every attack and fight every boss for twenty minutes. Is what that sounds like. Which, I mean, I can't imagine a better way of getting good at the game if you want to learn how to speed run it. I guess, but then just practice the speed run, right? I don't know. Yep, this is... Oh, this is this. I fucking hate this section of the game. I'm just gonna be honest with you. It's not my favorite. I don't like fighting snake eyes just in general. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, this is just an annoying boss, and... It's in a room full of enemies that shoot at you. Like, th there's always a stretch like this. Oh my god. Attack power one, charmless demon bell. With no deflect. I mean, I saw Lil Aggie did a run where he, um... Just stomped on bosses' heads, right? Which does, like, one damage. And that was the only way he could do damage. Um... Fuck that. Is, uh, my opinion on that, I think? I 
Like, I hate myself to some degree, but not to that degree. I'll, I'll tell you what. Um, I don't even remember the best way to approach this situation. Um, so there's those two enemies, right? And then that's the snake eyes over there, just above my character's head. And there's that guy who sucks ass and, and like has a giant shotgun. And then there's like enemies on the cliff. Oh yeah, he just used praying strikes. Well, no, that that was the the no deflect run, right? But he did one where he he just did, jumped on enemies' heads, right? He was fighting the ogre for like, oh no no no, he 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 only did the jumps on the ogre and then he got the praying strikes, right? Because the whole point was that it was like no sword, right? Yeah 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 yeah. Okay, I'm remembering now. God, it's been a while since I like caught any of those videos. Oh god, backstabbing that guy is huge. Fighting those guys sucks on a good day and. It's never a good day if you don't have a rose charm. <laughs> yeah, no sword, exactly, okay. Oh god, the, the boss has already seen me. And this boss has one particular move that she does all the time, which is like a grab, that does like your whole health bar, and has a really awkward deflect timing. So I, I'm just excited to get killed by that over and over. Really? Okay, where's the... Isn't there a guy on this cliff? Yes. There he is. Okay. Now, I, I have cheesed this entire boss by just letting it take poison damage. Um, which... I wouldn't be against doing again, to be honest. Um, but I feel like that would be really boring for the stream. It's the only reason. We could all, like, talk about our favorite Jonah videos or some shit, but... Fuck you. Yeah. Owl? I don't know why Owl makes it funny, but... I'm sure there are reasons. Owl does some annoying stuff. I remember the first time that I got, um, McCurried by Owl. I think I, like, cried a little bit. Yeah, so if I lure the boss into the poison, she will just eventually die. I don't even know if there is a way to, um... I will realize soon. Uh-oh. I don't even know if I can re-establish stealth from here. To go and backstab her. It sounds like the music's getting quieter, but it is hard to tell. No, she's not even in the poison either. Okay, well... Maybe I can get this one dead this time? Okay. That's a start. a really awkward shooting animation. It just, like, didn't play the animation for some reason. Oh, no. Charmless Owl is really bad. Uh-oh. Well, that scares me. Um. Yeah, Owl is hard just in general. Um... I was doing the boss rushes off stream this week to kind of uh, practice the game because I knew I wanted to do some kind of goofy challenge. Because um, I've just I've played this too many times on stream to just do it, or too many times off stream to just do it normally on stream. I feel like I would just like sprint through the whole game. Come on. Okay, so if I come down here. Right? This is the way to lure her into the poison, right? Hey, snake guys. There we go. Why don't you hang out in here? Oh, 
Owl and True Monk. Yeah, True Monk sucks. Just in general. Um, it's like when you're doing well on that boss, it's fine. Um, I feel like I'll, I'll be in like a unique position to do okay with True Monk because I just um, have been trying to do the Severance um, boss rush for like ever. Don't tell me they patched the game and she doesn't take poison damage anymore. Oh, okay. I didn't remember it taking this goddamn long. That boss is fun. I kind of don't like the terror attack. That's the one that I'm like... That doesn't need to be in the game. Yeah, so I've poisoned the boss. Now I can kind of just wait for that to do its thing. Fuck, I wanted to just Makiri that. Okay, this is the most scuffed attempt. Oh, I don't want to have to go and kill all those enemies again. Uh, but I have, like, no resources left. I'm gonna have to. Okay. I think the way to do this... Like, for sure, way to do this is just... Go around the outside of the room. Maybe kill these guys. Try to make sure that I don't aggro the boss yet. Who's... Oh, it's you. Okay, that's fine. Oh shit, the boss is kind of aggroed. Okay, well... Would you stop shooting that wall and walk over here? Because if I go over there, the other guy's gonna get line of sight on me. Yeah, Snake Eyes is pretty much my least favorite boss in this game. I'm just going to be honest with you. So I'm not looking forward to this. I just, I hate the grab move. It's fucking stupid. Snake Eyes. Where are you? Cool. The shotgun guy has seen me. That's good. Yep. I already hate you. Ah, the, the, the timing is dumb. It's like not when it looks like it should be. Oh, Alright. Yeah. Fuck me. Okay. Alright, you. Come on. We're going in the poison. Come on. Come on, Snake Eyes. Come on. I'm cheesing you. I don't care. I'm not fighting you for real. <laughs> I have to fight another one of you just to go to the gun fort. I don't want to do it. Come on. Ah! Okay, so now I just have to let the poison kill the boss. She's gonna have to get poisoned like two or three times. I think the easiest way to do it is, like, line of sight, and then back up so that she misses, and then step into line of sight again. So we're just gonna be doing this dance with the boss because... I hate that grab move, to be honest. <laughs> Hope y'all are doing alright in chat. Because <laughs> I'm doing this. <laughs> um, yeah, I was thinking about the rat movie. Uh, classic old dumb Germa thing. Okay, and now I'll just stand somewhere that she can't shoot me for a while. I'm, I'm tempted to put the controller down, but I know that if I do that, some random bullshit is going to kill me. And I really don't want to have to do this multiple times, so... Just want her to stay in the poison. This is incredibly cheesy, and I don't care. So I've got the Seven Spears guy. I've got to kill Lady Butterfly. Lady Butterfly can't be that bad, right? Pretty sure she's going to be. Um...
And then what else? I guess, yeah, the other snake eyes too. I have two snake eyes that I have to fight like right around the same time. The path to the gun fort has another one of the same boss. Oh god, the poison only does like a quarter of her health bar. I have to do this four times? I better not fuck it up then, huh? This is gonna take like 20 minutes. It would probably be faster to just try to fight her over and over, to be honest. But no, I want to keep my skill point progress. I don't care. Okay, she's poisoned again. Here we go. Oh, I was standing a little too close there. She could have just shot me. So the one is called Shirahagi and the other one is called like Sharahugi, right? That's probably wrong. Shara something? I don't know. And so after I beat the other snake eyes, I have to go fight the long armed centipede Senun thing. And that is probably going to be extra funny without Kuro's Charm, because the chip damage and posture damage that I'm going to take probably means just learn all the combo timing, or die, which I, I guess I'll learn all the combo timing. I doubt the devs intended for you to do this. I have literally done this every time that I've fought. I've, I've come through this game, though. It's probably unwise. If I had just fought the boss the normal fucking way, I probably would have learned the grab timing by now. But it's like, it's not when, so she's got this big pokey stick, right? It's not when it's like closest to you. It's like she pushes it closest to you and then it comes back a little bit and that's when the timing is. And that just screws with my head, man. And I even know that that's what it is, but I don't care. I will cheese the fuck out of this boss. So there's the Rat Movie 1, and then the Rat Movie 2. I, I don't know why, just like, I'll be, like, talking with friends or whatever, and, like, weird little cadences from those videos will, like, appear in my head. Michael, it's your birthday today. Oh my god, I almost died to that. That would have been fucking tragic. <laughs> Cake and ice cream is on its way. Um, and of course my dog needs to go out. Hi! Hi! Yes. Um, you think Snake Eyes will stay in the poison if I take you outside? It would be pretty funny if I died while away from the stream. I'm going to stand somewhere where I really don't think she can shoot me. And I will take my dog out. We'll see. <laughs> I'm just going to turn off the face cam and mute the mic. All right, I'll be right back. Engaging boss fight, huh? Come back inside to report that he just wanted to roll in the grass. It looks like Snake Eyes is dying though. Let me just check on this real quick. Yeah, she's in the poison. Okay, well, this is, seems to be going fine. Uh, why not? Uh, I'll, I'll go retrieve my dog and I'll be right back.
I am the most engaging streamer. We're gaming, ladies and gentlemen. The boss has no health left, and my dog has gone out. Um. So yeah, the um. Snake Eyes is done. <laughs> if you're worried that um I did not allow my dog to roll in the grass as he wanted to, never fear. I will absolutely go and allow him to roll in the grass um, after the stream. He just doesn't get to interrupt my stream so that he can do that. It's a funny little guy. Yeah, so if you beat Guardian Ape first before you come through this area, you have to fight two of them when you come through here. So like, obviously I will fight two of them, but I don't, I don't want to have to <laughs> to come through this area if you don't uh, need to. So I like to do things in this order for that reason. I think there is a additional um, thing to do here though. Somewhere on this path, I seem to remember he was back in this room. Yeah. There's a place to grapple to in here. I don't remember where it is. But there's for sure a place to grapple to. And I think it's like a, a whole ass prayer bead that you can get too. Oh, it's up there. Okay. Just missed it on the first path. It's, it's the item that's on top of the um, statue's head in the previous zone. I think it's this way. This seems right. Yeah. I remember running around looking for this, like, why can't I access it? Oh, okay, careful. <laughs> it would be funny if I fell off after all that. That is the third prayer bead. I think there are a few others that we can get pretty easily from here. <laughs> yeah, um, thank you for the GG. I appreciate it. That is that is just always how I handle that boss. I don't know. It's, I, I should probably um, take it a little more seriously, but who cares? <laughs> um, is this the monkey with the item? Yes. Yeah. And I think this is actually the canonically like this. These bones up here is the monkey that gets resurrected. Uh, or something. I don't know. There's something related to that. That's like a thing for later. All right. Uh, let's just. Oh, there's this whole misty area, isn't there? Oh, guys, the the hardest boss is coming up. I gotta fight oh, Mist Noble. She was, she was here just um, this is the guy who really the likes the Shire Sen, huh? Oh, I... I think she just kills him if you if you let him go and find her. It's pretty funny, to be honest. There's a whole bunch of items in this area. <laughs> Miss Noble jump kick only. I, I don't even think it's that hard to kill that boss that way, is it? He's like so easy that even doing like immense challenges against him are still not bad. Um. Ah! I just, I pressed the fun button. I tried to pick the item pickup button and I pressed the jump button instead. Oops, okay. That's a lot of damage. Oh, hello, another guy. Okay, it's fine. Got the items. You can kind of ignore these items for now and then go kill Miss Noble and then all the enemies are gone from the zone. That's usually the way that I would do this, but it's kind of funnier to go and do it all now. Hey, hey you. <laughs> it took 19 minutes of just jumping? You know the path of That's one awful. One who opposed. Correct. <laughs> he sealed away the, the village and abandoned. Yes, the door. Here's the thing that you need to do so that you can complete the video game. I am... I exist only for exposition. I shouldn't be making fun of it. I mean, what are they going to do? Not put exposition in the game? That wouldn't be better, but... Is there a thing to do up here? Oh, oh god, I fell pretty far, huh? I think there's a headless in here, and I, that is... Unabashedly, I say Snake Eyes is my least favorite enemy in the game. It's actually the Headless. Um, new game plus seven and Charmless Demon Bell. Yeah. 
Well, you're insane for doing all that. Um, but my god, you're good at the game. If, if you manage to achieve all that, that's crazy. Isn't there another Juzo mini boss like right here? I definitely remember there being. You can kind of cheese this one too, if I remember. Correct. Oh my god, these chickens give so much XP. What the hell? I don't remember that being the case. The terrain is pretty cool in this area, I gotta say. The way it like splits apart and stuff. This was probably a pain in the ass to make in whatever map editor they use. 47 out of 56. That seems pretty good. Ghost dogs, my favorite. Um. Yeah, some of those bosses are really rough. Not jump kick only, that's literally impossible. Yeah, okay, that makes sense to be the thing that you did for Miss Noble. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey! Alright, well, you know what? I should just go kill Miss Noble before I do this. But... I don't want to. Whatever. I'm pretty sure this is just like the path to kill Miss Noble too, isn't it? I think it puts you on the roof. Oh my god. Yeah, you are you definitely have more of a resolve than me. If something takes me three days to do in one of these games, I tend to try to find an easier way to do it. Um, that is crazy. Yeah, Ape Duo with all those restrictions seems like a bad time. Okay, so this is the hardest boss in the game. Ocean Man, if you're still here, pay attention. I hope you're listening. This is the hardest boss in the game. Oh no. He got me. <laughs> I, I could have stomped on the boss at least a couple times just for funnies, but... Whatever. Um... Okay, now I shouldn't be getting shot anymore. I know there's like a skip that you can do to get in there really fast. The Miss Noble from Aggie's videos, I guess. That's probably where I saw it. Let's get this item. I think this stream will actually help my um, average view count a lot. I think I've had like three of y'all in here for most of the time, and that's good. If I can get my um, average viewer count above three uh, before I hit 50 followers, then I'll just pretty much get um, affiliate right when I hit the follower number, which would be pretty ideal. Um, I'm not necessarily doing this to try to like get rich and be famous or whatever on Twitch, but... Um, making this, like, in some way my job would be pretty sick, to be honest. I think I was gonna say, the monkeys just jump up here and fight me, don't they? It sounds really funny when multiple of them are blocking you at once. Oh god, they, uh, they do meaningful damage, huh? Maybe I don't do this right now. Let's let's just go do the next thing. I don't have enough health to justify trying to fight Juzu right here. Or whatever his name is. Yeah, the thing is I, I try to do like variety stuff, so I'm I'm not like playing the same game for too long. So I have people come in who are like ultra fans of like Bloodborne or Sekiro or whatever. And then it's like actually like the game that I play most consistently is probably Team Fortress 2. <laughs> um, and, and there are even people who are probably following me just for that. And I don't know. D doing variety stuff is kind of what I want to do. I don't want to get pigeonholed into any one game because any one game will eventually just dry up, right? And then you got to try to pivot from that and that oh, fuck all that. I'd rather just play all the games that I like, you know? I have five skill points, huh? Let's, um...
Let's get this for sure. Um, where was the one that... I want to take less posture damage. Reduces the amount of posture damage when attacked by an enemy. Yeah, that seems good. Um, and then I'll get these two. Perfect. Emma's medicine is probably worth getting to eventually. Um, all right. Have I got any send to give you? 400 is at least something. I guess I could go fight the, um, I could just go fight the Corrupted Monk now, huh? I don't know if I'm ready for that, but I could try- Oh, this enemy's hard as hell, isn't he? Yeah, I remember you. Oh, I didn't get the item. Oh god, and he will just chase me forever, too. I remember this. He chased me, like, almost all the way to the arena for the Corrupted Monk the one time. I was like, what are you doing? Cut it out, man. There's nothing over there. But if we get the breathing technique now, it'll actually um make it easier to get upgrade materials uh, later on. Like when we go to the Senpu Temple. Although maybe I want to just go do Senpu Temple first, actually, because I doubt the Armored Warrior is going to be that hard. Um, and I bet you the Mortal Blade makes this encounter easier. In fact, I would bet money that it does. Oh, Gord Seed. Cool. Um... See all these kanjis? I don't care. Maybe that's not the plural for that word? I don't know. I have never been, like, a... a big, like, Japan enthusiast, like some people for sure are. Which is fine, like, if, if that's the thing that you're super into. Um... But, like, I will just, like, pronounce shit wrong. Oh, God, yes, I wanted a wall hang. How did you know, game? <laughs> oh, these enemies are actually kind of scary looking. <laughs> okay, here we go. I could go fight the Shamisen warrior, but I remember her being hard as fuck, too. Oh, God. I almost got knocked out of the bonfire again. I have three out of four prayer beads. Let me think where there are more prayer beads to pick up. I got a gourd seed here. Do you get a prayer bead for defeating the Shamisen warrior? I feel like you do. But she's gonna kick my ass, right? She's like really hard. Orin? Of the wind or whatever? You get upset with me if I run past you too, don't you? phone is ringing again. I'd at least like to know, but no matter how many letters I send, he never writes an action you. What is this voice acting? <laughs> yep. Yeah, this boss is really hard. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do any of this. Is there like an item over there? Give me that. I find it pretty funny that they let you drink a gourd underwater. Maybe my dog did actually have to go outside when we were out and he just chose to go in the grass? I don't know. <laughs> and roll around? This is just divine grass. Uh, maybe I will actually try to make a point of using that, this playthrough. I, I've used it before. I remember one of my successful attempts to beat Ishin. Um, I actually... Uh, used a divine grass and I felt very proud of myself because like those are always the too good to use items right it's like nobody uses it because it's just like too valuable oh my god he's losing his mind can I get on this roof yet yeah losing his goddamn mind okay I know I just did this but I am going to have to again take a quick break I'm sorry guys I know. I know we will. Okay. Just one moment, guys. Sorry.
so dumb. I'm so dumb, I'm so dumb. One day I will remember to actually unmute the microphone properly when I come back. Um, but today is not that day, apparently. Um, just hemorrhage and viewers every time I walk away from the screen, but that's kind of just the name of the game. Yes, it's all me. I'm hiding him from you. How did you know? Isn't there a way, like, under this building or something? I don't remember. There is. Very nice. Weirdest rotating door in the game. I like a lot. Red lump. That's a gross thing. Let's see. Yeah, there's an item back here. And then I'm pretty sure there's like a prairie beat on the roof, right? And then I can get a little extra health before I fight the noble. That seems like a good bet. Um, yeah. This is a prayer bead, right? Hell yeah. I knew it. All right. There is a way on the roof, right? The roof roof. I don't think I need to go up there, though. Anything else up here in this little section? I don't think so. Did I not get all of the spirit emblems? That's kind of weird. Ah, here it is. There is an item up here. I knew it. It's 500 sen. It's definitely worth getting. Okay. I guess we'll go back to the... Um, idle. I wanted to call it a bonfire again. Oh, am I in Oren's zone? Yeah, I am. Sorry, Oren. I'm just worried she's gonna, like, teleport up to me. I kind of hate seeing the little remnants everywhere. Can I just, like, switch to offline mode? Network settings? I don't know if that actually changed me to offline mode. I think that just made it so the next time I launch the game it'll be offline? Sure. Whatever. Okay. Oh right, I have to actually do the thing. Let's not forget. Enhance physical attributes. Boom! Way more health. Alright, I think it's time to go give the monk a shot and probably die. Quite badly. Um, and I know there are ways to cheese the monk, too, with snap seeds and fistfuls of ash and various things, but oh, I think I can do it. I think I can do it. I think it is actually advantageous to go around the room at the start, though. I don't remember. You definitely just can't get a stealth death blow. Ouch. Okay. boss a lot. So I feel like I'm decently ready was what I was going to say, but I'm, now I'm getting owned. She has just like so much posture recovery too. It's really hard to like do damage to her without the confetti. Oh 
comically little damage I do. Shit. The posture just comes back so fast. <laughs> a lot of skill point that I just lost. That's okay. We'll give this another shot. I should probably just equip the Divine Confetti here. Um, how many do I have is the question. I have 11. I feel like that's definitely enough to do this. There's a way to buy infinite confetti later, but I don't know what it is. So, I don't know. Um... Right, and this tree makes it a bit easier to go up here. Alright. Let's see. Attempt number two. Shit. I immediately died. Fuck you. Monk. <laughs> If you can hear my dog freaking out. Because he really is freaking out. Shit. I thought I would have time to jump. I didn't. Oh, god damn it. That move. It, I swear there's like two versions of it. And they have very slightly different timing. I'm probably just making shit up though. Okay, that was dumb. Yep. Very, very dumb. I, well, I don't know what you need. Dog. I don't know what it is. Yeah. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> we're, we're having a day today. It's, it's going just fine. Um... Let's give that one more attempt. Um, trying to think of what else I could do that's productive other than this uh, right now. I might wrap up for the day kind of soon, actually. Not to see me. Um, oh, you too. How dare you hide? It would be really nice to, to get the breathing technique, though. I would be pretty happy to do that. Okay. Confetti. To a great start. Shit. Glad that sweep like completely missed me. That was terrible. Never, never block that move. Doing okay. Shit. Gaming. My confetti's already up. Shit. Ah. Thought I got that timing, I guess not.
is this posture on this boss? It's so bad. Wait, I... Do I just have to fight it perfectly forever? <laughs> yes. I thought I stunned you out of that move, I didn't. Don't get your posture back. Fuck you. God, I hate that. It's all gone. Doing okay. This is just, like, a very hard encounter. You have to use the confetti. Just like in general. And there's a limited amount of it, so I don't I don't know what I will do. Um once I run out. Uh I, mean, I, I could go fight the other snake eyes and the centipede. Um I feel like that would be pretty productive. Um I'll keep trying this for a little bit though. It just snap seeds. Yeah, I I know that snap seeds do it. I just don't want to. I don't want to use them all. And then, like, lose <laughs> uh, is my concern. I guess I'll equip them here. These are also finite because fucking of course they are. Like, I get making the game hard. All of that is cool, but finite. Um, materials that I need to actually do damage to the boss. Like, I don't really like that. I don't know how that didn't hit me. Posture is just always gone. She just, like, blocks you a lot, too. It's, like, hard to actually hit the boss, because she just, like, successfully blocks you almost every time. Look. Fuck you. I mean, so now I, I have two options, like, accept that this is done, or use all this... The Snapseed didn't do anything? Excuse me? Was I, like, out of range? Okay, I think you can only do it, like, three times. Fuck you. See, this is why- oh no! Well, I didn't want to use the snap seeds, because it always ends in tears. Yep. 
Okay. It's like I'm playing pretty perfectly. How long do I have to do this for? Fuck, a little longer. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Fuck it. Okay. If I immediately died, I would actually cry. Like, real tears. I'm actually out of healing items now. Fuck. Okay, I gotta do this. I have to. That was... <laughs> use the Divine Grass. You, you, if it's too good to use, no it's not. It's too good, you gotta use it. <sighs> just, just watch the skill bar just go forever now. How many skill points is that gonna be? I feel like I fought her a little early too. At least four? Five? Okay. I, I got a whole 20% bonus, too. Oh my god, my heart rate is going so... so crazy right now. Oh, that's so satisfying to do that, though. Um, I think this... Is there, like, a key item to come and get in here? Or is this the place that we come later on, once we get all the key items? I think this is the place we come later on. But there may also be a thing sitting here. A flower? Oh no, this is the stone. Yeah, so that's kind of gross. Somebody, um... Somebody drank a whole ton of... One step closer to Charmless with Demon Belt. Look, man, maybe eventually. Maybe eventually, but goddamn, it's hard. Just as is. Um... Yeah, somebody drank so much water that they got a giant kidney stone the size of, like... A basketball <laughs> and then that's one of the incense materials we need is like the big stinky kidney stone <laughs> it's like what is in that water man <laughs> I'm gonna be honest I really didn't think I was gonna do with that try that was crazy that was fucking crazy okay um so I could we could go to Senpu temple I haven't done anything there or we could go to the gun fort um, those are both good options uh, I guess, fine. I don't want to do it, so... Oh, you know what? Actually, I have to use the bathroom really quick, so I'm just going to be annoying, and we're going to have... This is going to be the stream of a million BRBs. I'm so sorry. You want me to do Senpu? I will do Senpu, but it's going to take, like, 30 seconds. Sorry. Drop my headset on my keyboard and something changed in OBS and I don't know what it was. That's uh okay. We'll, we'll see what happens. Um let's let's do Semper Temple. That's a good idea. Oh yeah yeah, there is a I left. Well it's fine. Um I know there's a prayer bead there. Um I don't have three, so going to get the other one isn't really gonna matter all that much. Um like, even worth going? Uh, yeah, we'll go talk to the guy. Why not? There's an NPC here. <laughs> Where did everyone go? No, do I, I don't do? remember what to do for, like, the good ending for Why this guy. Everyone's gone. I'm all I did get the one on the rooftop. Yeah. What? This guy, this, you can bring this guy, like, a pinwheel, and he, um does something and there's like two pinwheels you can get for him one of them is like the bad ending and one of them is the good ending 
Um, I don't remember what... The, so, there's another puzzle that you have to... See that little guy down there with the hat? You have to backstab him and then ninjutsu him. And then he releases the kite, and then you can go and, like, stab the snake in its face. Um, I just haven't... Uh, I think it's probably Guardian Ape that you need to do to get that, right? These guys are hard, actually. Probably, like, very hard without Kuro's Charm, so I could just run past all this shit, to be honest. Oh, that was not where I thought it was going to grapple me to, but I'll take it. Return ending? Yeah, I want to do the good ending. Um... Oh, really? Puppeteer you just get for killing the monkeys? I thought it was, um... I thought it was Guardian Ape. Okay, well then we'll get it soon, actually. Kind of makes sense for that to be a self-contained puzzle, like everything you need for it is in the area that uh, it's in. I like that kind of design. Owl Father is going to be like an absolute nightmare, though, isn't he? For the return uh, ending. Um... I mean, Owl Father is usually just awful, in general. Um... Bring this lady rice, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Persimmons, which is actually just snake hearts. Mm, yummy. Ape drops the whistle, Ape Duo drops the bestowal ninjutsu, right. Which is really good, actually. I like that, um... A lot, but once you, um... Use that ninjutsu... Then that kite um, down there gets strung up, and then we can use it to grapple across to that ledge over on the other side. Um, probably do all that eventually, but... Oh, hello. <laughs> There's actually some terrifyingly hard enemies in this area, too. Um, these guys? Let's see if I can just... Oh, nope. I definitely cannot. Just backstab him, so I will just take the items and go. Oh, that's not an item, is it? Oh, that is, though. I think that guy needed the antidote, huh? And another item. Sure. Give me that. Thank you. Oh, there's a grapple. Oh, he's for purification. Which ending am I thinking? Purification is like the good, good ending though, right? The really hard one <laughs> that you have to do like so many chores to get. I feel like that's the one that I want to get. I got the good ending in Bloodborne. I feel like I can definitely do it in this game. There's a shopkeep right here, right? I have like no scent. Oops. The Divine Child and the Rice. Yeah, yeah. Here to purchase it on. Another one. Hey, you find Don't you need the, the serpent hearts for you that, though? The memorial mob. Uh, I guess not. Go ahead. Um, the five color rice is literally just like the... That's the one where he dies. Oh, weird. Okay. I can never remember. A return is for killing the serpent. I see, I see, I see. The five color rice is literally just like um, prism stones in Dark Souls, uh, which is not really like who, who cares <laughs> about prism stones most of the time. Um, like the, there aren't like uh, mazy sorts of um, areas that like justify that in this game. I feel like compared to Dark Souls One. Where, like, you may very much want to use that in Tomb of the Giants. Oh, these enemies are annoying, aren't they? Oh, shit. Oh, I just fell. Is this that pinwheel? No. I know there's a pinwheel around here somewhere. Um, I'll try to do all the stuff for all of the endings. How, how about that? <laughs> That's my goal. Half light. Yeah, literally like those um, PvP encounters, huh? The only time anybody ever uses those. It's like more stuff to do over here, but I don't remember how to how to do it. I think this is just 
Yeah. The Armored Warrior. But I feel like the Demon Bell Temple is, like, right around here somewhere. This is the pinwheel. Right, 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 right. That makes sense. It's amid a whole bunch of its friends. Are these actually physics objects I can interact with, or do just some of them spin? Seems like some of them just spin. Sad. Oh, yeah, the demon temple's nearby, huh? It's right there. I can see it from here. Only half light. Okay, yeah. I can't argue with that, can I? How do you get over to the demon temple again? I feel like it's pretty nearby. Oh, it's this. Right. Oh yeah, and then this funny thing where you have to jump and then ledge grab. Oh yeah? I just thought you meant, like, people use them to be funny in PvP. Which, like, yeah, they do, but that's not even, like, really a use. Um... The carvings are even better for that. Um... I remember Half-Light being really annoying, actually. But just the boss in general. I think I got some sweaty PvP players, um... The last time I played it, which is fine. I, I mean, it would be fine if the Dark Souls netcode wasn't total dog shit. It's so, like, unbelievably bad. I I really don't know what... Like, what, what were they doing? I don't know. Um, what is this? Oh, yeah? That's actually... Super weird. Shinobi escape route leads to Demon Bell, huh? From where? Is this a headless? Oh, fuck this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not fighting the headless right now. You can get infinite use sugars from them, and the sugars give you bonuses, but uh, I don't care. <laughs> I don't, I don't... They're not worth it most of the time. There's like one maybe that's worth doing. But like, who uses the resistance sugars? No one does. Maybe on a challenge run is the time that it would actually be worth using. Yeah, so I could ring the demon bell if I wanted, and then there would be extra difficulty and rewards as well, but I'm not going to do it for now. I really wish you could just jump across to that from up here, but I don't think you can. Yeah, resistance is dumb. I agree. Nobody's using that shit. Oh, I can't get back, can I, at all? Ah! <laughs> okay, I don't know why it just wouldn't let me grapple. Maybe you're not supposed to go that direction. In fact, I'm sure that's what it is. You're definitely not supposed to go that direction. I didn't use any of my skill points, did I? <laughs> Every time I get unseat aid, it's when I have, like, no money. I swear. Um... I kind of want more health. That seems good. Um... And then I probably want Breath of Nature next. Um, I guess I'll just go to the other... Oops. The other Spirit Idol, whatever. Sculptor's Idol, not Spirit Idol. I don't know what I'm saying, man. Um, and I, I don't think the Armored Warrior is going to be difficult at all, to be honest. It's possible. Let's jump right over that guy. Who cares? Um, the armored warrior shouldn't be that hard. It definitely can't be harder than the last boss that I fought. Close. 
It would be funny if he had posture, um, regen when you, um, are doing the challenge run. This guy fights a big guy from Dark Souls 3, I swear. Are really an Elden Ring enemy, to be honest. I can't tell if you're saying I'm bad, or if you're suggesting a challenge. No, I, I know you're not saying I'm bad. That's just funny. I think this is like the one enemy in this game with no posture recovery. Okay. Yes, he is not hard. Oh, you don't actually get to see him fall? Sad. You hear the thud, though. Okay, so I happen to know that there's an, a prayer bead underwater in the next area. Right? There's like a pool with a prayer bead in it. That Now that I have the Mibu breathing technique, I can just get. Pretty sure it's this pool, actually. Whee! That, right. I'm pretty sure this is a prayer bead, though, right? Yeah! Nice. And so the, then there's a third one in the Mibu village area. And maybe the fourth one for killing Orin? I don't really remember. May as well get the treasure card while I'm here. Centipede mini boss, yeah. Yeah, I'm ready for the centipede. There's two of them, um, and I'm near both of them. Well, I guess not near both of them. I, um, both of them are are soon coming up shortly in the in the game. I guess you could say, because I have to go fight the other. Um, I thought I would be able to stand on that. I guess I can't. I have to go fight the other snake eyes, which I I don't wanna. <laughs> um. I seem to remember there being a lot to do in this area. This little stretch. Just in the middle of this courtyard, just these guys that are like annoying as hell. Just wax! Oh god, I got stuck. And I think once you get the mortal blade, you can kill those guys with the centipedes, but I definitely can't yet. At least not permanently. I saw that dark coming for me, man. So, am I correct in thinking that there's a path down and a path up? Yes, there is. I'll go do this first. It's like the least good path to do what I'm doing. Yeah, I'm gonna fight the centipede. He's probably gonna kick my ass, to be honest. Because just... The, um... The Kuro's charm is just gonna fuck me. The lack of it, rather. I always forget you actually have to, like, unlock the, um, like, swings right after you grapple onto something. Boss has seen me, but I'm not sure. What? Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> I could reestablish stealth and get a death blow for free. Oh, just jump right on them? I knew there was, like, a, a good way of killing them. 
Thanks for the tips, by the way. I appreciate it. Okay, yeah. I, I'll just have to run away. Be a coward. I don't feel like doing both, um... Health bars. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Just the qu sheer quantity of yellow triangles is like lagging the uh, thing that tracks them. That's pretty funny. Kill the little guy. Okay. I can definitely recover from this. This isn't too bad. Nice. Okay. That was a, a little scuffed, but I did it. All right, I have three prayer beads. I'm pretty sure I can just get one more in the Mibu village, like you said, which is pretty sick. <laughs> that, that, that was really scuffed, but, um, you know, whatever. It, it all worked out in the end. I don't think there's anything on the other side of this building. Oh, God. Oh, there's a lot of dogs. What the fuck? Now there aren't. You've poisoned me. How rude. Okay. I don't have to fight any of these monks if I don't want to, to be honest. Maybe there being an item around here somewhere that was worth getting, though. We got a whole bunch of prayer beads in this area, though. That was very good. Oh, it's around the back of this building that there's a thing to go and do. I remember now. And there's there's no chance that I'm fighting the double... These guys? They're too hard. I'm not doing it. <laughs> it's just not worth it. It's not worth my time. Especially when there's a bonfire literally right here. Uh, I remember the monkeys are annoying. There's like a couple good ways to fight them, but I don't remember exactly what they are. I know there's one that spawns like right behind you at the beginning. Right, that's just the path to the inner sanctum, isn't it? Um, yeah, there's one that's behind you right at the beginning. So that one I'll try to make sure I kill right away. Yeah, this is the thing I was thinking of. It's behind the... building. I think there's an NPC that tells you to come do this eventually, but... Who cares? I'll do it early. I don't care. If you go up, that's just the same path, right? I have to go this way. This feels right. Oh, if you jump, you can literally just death blow them immediately? That's so silly. What? Okay, I don't know how I didn't know that. I have how many playthroughs through this game? Oh, the item hasn't even spawned on him yet. That's fucking goofy. There's an item that spawns on that corpse later. Um, but I haven't done the thing that I need to yet to make it happen. So it's just not here. Funny game. But I can get this, which is, I think, the, um, the book. Yeah. So now we have all of the skill trees available to us, I think. You could correct me if I'm wrong. Kill monkey behind you. Grapple and backstab red monkey. Grapple to middle, grapple forward. Use bell. 
Backstab Green Monkey, use Illusory Hall Bell. Oh, uh, that's too complicated for me to, to like guarantee get it right on the first try. But like, um, use Gaichin Sugar and then enter the boss arena. Okay, that part I can at least do. Um, are there multiple items up in the rafters here, or just the one? God. Feels really weird, like, climbing these statues like this. Yeah, well, that's probably because it's not the right way to do it, huh? They want you to just grapple up. Sure. Oh, no, there is another item over here. Yeah, I just, I don't want to do what I did my first playthrough and spend 17 years in that boss arena. Um, enter boss arena. Kill monkey behind you. Grapple and backstab the red monkey. I think the red one is on the tree, right? Oh, I got a Jesus statue, too. It's right in front. Yeah, on the tree. Okay. I think I got this. I mean, I definitely won't die. It just might take a while. <laughs> Use bell. I'm going to skip the cutscene. Shit. Oh, did I get it? I did. Okay. Okay, well... I don't think that was the right strat, but I did it. I think this bell is the one to kill the green monkey, isn't it? Where the fuck is the red one, then? I should really curse less on stream, huh? This is the one that just runs forever until I do the... the, like, water thing? Wait, can I just do this? No. Right, 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 right. Okay. That's the purple one, isn't it? Um, the illusory hall bell? Um, I think that's this one, right? Over here to the left. back at the start. That's pretty funny. Oh, the red one spawns, like, right up here, doesn't it? Okay. I see footprints. What? Okay, sure. Um. Resets all monkey positions. Is that the one right in the front? Oh, what? I, tr I tried to drop down and then grapple and the game just said no. Uh-uh. Okay, there's literally just one left, right? Oh, the <laughs> it's in my inventory. Right. Duh. <laughs> I have two gourd seeds that I haven't turned in. Who's a dummy? It's me. Uh, is it not a key item? I guess it must be a usable item, huh? Elusive hall bell, huh? I see the monkey. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I do. Into 
the dark room. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, it's done. There we go. Folding monkeys. Flawless, right? I didn't, like, fall into a pit twice like a dumbass. And it just teleports me out of here, right? Yeah. Okay, Mortal Blade time. I definitely want to get this before you go fight Guardian Ape, I'll tell you that. It makes that boss fight way easier. I guess you know what I should do when I, um... When I've got extra sense, just buy Spirit Emblems. Uh, is there a limit to how many of those you can carry? Probably like 999. It's <laughs> just funny how they all turn away from you on the fan. <laughs> Every time it cuts to Wolf's face, I'm... He's just making like this face. He's, he's making like... Sigma face all the time. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'm making that up. It's, I feel like his face does look funny though. He looks about as tired as I do all the time. <laughs> I gotta say that is my own fault for just not getting enough sleep ever, but... So we'll go talk to a child. Oh yeah, and I got the puppeteer, huh? Oh, that... I'm dumb. I didn't mean to do that. Where's the exit? Uh, oopsie. There's like an NPC that you can come and talk to in here. I'm glad I don't have to do like a full loading screen to go back and forth though. I thought that was the sculptor's idol, that was just stupid. Huh? I have three and a half skill points, huh? Better Makiri seems good, actually. Seems very good. Better heal is also nice. Oh, Ichimonji double is actually, like, really strong, isn't it? Um. I know Ichimonji double is really good against Owl, specifically. Let's, let's do the better Makiri. That seems good. Um, are there items in this area? I don't think so. There's the door that I can go and open, but it's kind of pointless to do that. Why do you seek this? I seek the... Do you know of the blade that can... Yes. It is so cold. This dialogue is so good. Yet you... I do. I see. Okay. Well, at least this cutscene is sick as hell. It's like, well... If you it kills you if you prepared. open it? I can't die. <laughs> you may gaze upon the blade. It honestly would be really funny if you just like open the blade and then suddenly the game just cuts to like a game over screen. It's like, well, we told you that you were going to die. Kind of a clever use of the, um... Are they not loath to die? The whole thing with resurrection in this game. Clever use of it in a cutscene. <gasps> how... How are you... I don't know how much longer I'm gonna go for. I feel like this was a pretty good stream. Your eye. Maybe we'll go kill Snake Eyes and the other centipede. And then I'll call it. Because I feel like I could do that in 20 minutes or so. Blade, uh, that gr I'm gonna be mad at the grab. I accept its power. Oh, we have the mortal blade. Now I'm just gonna yes. exhaust yes. your dialogue. Oh, it's actually strategically good to use the rice as a healing item too. I remember. Um, it's like a very effective healing item. Um, it's like pellets, but just way better. Let's go turn in those gourd seeds. Um, resting is probably a waste of time when I'm gonna travel. Uh, in fact, it just definitely is. We'll give the gourd seeds to Emma. 
And then, um, I don't know what. I am scared of True Monk. <laughs> that is something I am that like nervous about. That is upcoming. It is seen. Yes. Please. What is it? I thought it would just be a favorite tea, huh? <laughs> I'm glad you've come. But I just jump instead of um skipping the dialogue. It's always funny. So what do I have? Eight gourd seeds now? So then, or huh? Huh. Goodbye. Wolf, I found something. It's a stone. A stone? Yes. Oh, I've already got this, so literally. Right, it says a, mm. <gasps> a unique scent. The stinky strange, kidney stone. Rock, you Is that... My lord, this stone. Did you get the stinky yes, kidney stone? I did. It was... Nope. Lord. The dialogue. Good god. Perhaps we should... Oh, and then Emma's gonna say, "Go get the mortal blade," which I already have. There is something yeah. the oh, it, it is true that the devourer. The mortal blade. Yep. Yes, here. here you are. Will you I this I should have. Well, I've already done all this. Oh, and then it switched me to offline mode. Sure. Wolf. It is the stream seems like it's still doing okay. Yes, it was the mummers. No. Yes, many. Yeah. I love dialogue. Okay, cool. Um, so glad I did all of that. Uh, let's go to the gun forts. That seems like a good uh, place to go next. Uh, Great Serpent Shrine. Oh, I forgot to go and get the... Ah, there was something else I want to do first. Well, we'll sit through a couple loading screens, not the end of the world. Oh! Hi! It's uh, Ishin! Who are hmm? they, they find, find a way. Oh, so by the way, have, have you mastered, mastered anything? Mm -hmm. Not quite cut them down. down. <laughs> have I mastered any secret techniques? I think that means, have you done to the end of a skill tree? And the answer is no, I have not. Once you do that, he gives you something else. I don't remember what it was. Uh, let's enhance the attack power. <clears throat> and we'll go back to the Mibu village right quick um and underwater i think there is a fourth prayer bead so we can get one more upgrade uh, before we go and fight this fucking snake eyes um there's no way to cheese this one like you could with the last one you can establish stealth which i don't consider cheesing but um it is something that you can do Is there anything over on this side of the lake that I haven't got? I feel like no. So maybe? I don't know really any of this. Oh, that's that. Right, 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 right. Um. Where does this lead? I guess I kind of remember this a little bit now. Adamantite, I, I think, was actually pretty hard to get. Pine Resin Ember? What the hell is that? Pine Resin Ember. Oh, for upgrading the Flame Vent. <laughs> I, like, f completely forgot that was in the game, like, at all. Maybe I just never got it. That would be funny. Although, I think I've done all the upgrades. I have the Platinum uh, Trophy, so I think I must have uh, done it all at some point. Okay. Prayer Veed should be in this water. There's like a chest at the bottom, right? There we go. Oh, and this is the carp with the red eyes, huh? Why is that item not... There's something about this carp's eyes. You can like, yeah, <laughs> we, we stole its eyes. Seriously, why can't I get this item? That was really weird. Okay, nice. 
trying to think if there's anywhere else in the game that there are um things that you need to go underwater to access. Can I use this from down here? I guess so. I don't, I don't think I need to, though. It's probably just faster to run back to the idol. I guess we could um, stop off at this merchant while we're here and spend some of the send that we got. May as well, right? Maybe some... Uh... Oh, you've got no pellets left, huh? It actually does seem like a good idea to spend the sin, so I'll do it. Why not? I think the sake is literally just for like lore <laughs> to like talk to an NPC with, so I don't, I don't think that's worth doing. I mean, you could much more easily spend that money doing anything that makes you stronger. Um. Okay, I don't remember how many prayer necklaces there are, but we have to have gotten a lot of them so far. Okay, now we will go do snake eyes and stuff. Um, and what time is it now? Where am I? Oh, weird. I mean, I like full screened. That's what I did. I like full screened OBS. Okay. I, because my like controller or something or my headphone set or something hit my keyboard. Um, I was like, what did I do? Okay. Oh, this is another one of these right here and I just never got it. I feel like there might be a few too many idols in this game. And people say that about Dark Souls 3 and I, I agree in both cases. There's just a few too many checkpoints. What the fuck are you? Okay, I have no idea why that guy's here. I've never seen him before. Going up. There's a thing to do up here. No respect for you. Not at all. Shit. I, I, I got launched at like a really weird angle. I got lucky that didn't kill me. Okay, heal up, heal up. Because I was locked onto the enemy, it did some, like some weird shit. There we go. I've already done this. Um. Sorry, I got some text messages from uh, the guy that I work with at the music store. Oh, it's a gourd seed. Huh. I guess I am glad that I did this. Came up here. Um, is that all there is? I think so. Kind of dizzying the height in this game sometimes. I don't get back. Ah. I did beat Genichiro. I probably beat him like right after you left, to be honest. I actually got like a, a perfect um, phase against Tomoe. Uh, the Tomoe phase. And I was pretty proud of myself. Um, like, I, I maybe like blocked instead of deflected two shots. Um. Yeah, I mean, we, we killed a bunch of bosses uh, this stream already, some of which were an <laughs> abject nightmare. Um, but some of them weren't too bad. Um, cheese the last Snake Eyes, so I'm not super excited to go and fight another one, but we'll do it. Thanks for catching the stream again. I appreciate it. All right, there's all these scary-ass enemies right here. There's just an idol, so you don't really have to care. Yeah, that enemy is genuinely very scary. 
Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Okay, you just missed. That's fine. Two achievements from Plat and Bloodborne, huh? That's awesome. This is such a sick area. I really love the way they designed all of this. Just the gun port in general is just so cool. Okay, so we're just gonna run immediately this way. gone far enough. Snake Eyes will have lost track of me. We'll see, though. Nope, she didn't. <laughs> She's looking right at me. Okay. So I think I have to run, like, halfway down the bridge, actually. I, I think I didn't go far enough. Serpentine. I don't see the yellow. Oh, I see. I see the yellow icon, but I don't see the red icon. Are we still good? Oh, the combat music's going away. That's good news. And she diagros. Hell yeah. Really slow. Remember this being touchy. Ha, I did it. Careful I don't go too far in that direction because she will um, get me shot by other <laughs> gun guys. Fuck. I just failed the parry. Fuck. Gotta dodge that shot. Probably could parry it, but. Come over here. Yeah, see, I got shot by your friends. That's exactly what I didn't want. Come on. Come fight me over here. Fuck, man. What is the timing for that? Going in that direction. I, I got it once. I will never get the timing again. Oh, what? I thought I died. Okay. I could just jump. Fuck it, I'll just jump. Fuck your grab. Haha, <laughs> snake guys. Okay, that was one try. I'll take it. Not the cleanest kill of my life, but I will take it nonetheless. Now, I think I want to come down here, grab this item, and then immediately hightail it out of here so I don't get shot <laughs> from like six angles at once. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Please tell me that's not enough to kill me. Ah. Thank you for the GGs. I appreciate it. Um, I, I can't really go back and rest, can I? Well. I'll just not get hit. It'll be fine. 
Serpentine, right? Serpentine, serpentine. That was too close. Gonna knock me into hell. I got really lucky. Okay. Operation run past all this shit and get into the gun fort is underway. Fuck, I've, I've been seen from over there. I probably should have killed that guy. Now, I know there's stuff on the ground that makes a whole lot of noise that you want to avoid stepping on. Just backstab you for fun. know if I have any skills that are worth one that I could get. I don't think so. There's some items back there that I want to get before we go fight the centipede. Snap seeds are nice. Still definitely more items out and about here, so let's go get them. All those things on the ground explode and make a whole bunch of noise if you step on them, so I don't want to do that. Isn't there? Yes. And some more stuff up here. How do I get to that, though? Right, you respawned. I almost forgot. Sure. I think that's most of the stuff, most of the goodies. There's a little bit more down here. Actually, is this like a thing to do? No, this is just where we came from. Okay, that's fine. Or where you can come from, I guess. I don't think that's the exact path I took. I, I haven't been doing so good at um, staying close to the mic, so I'm trying to do a little better this stream than I have in the past sometimes. Okay. I bet you I could just go backstab one more of those guys and get my, um, get my skill point up, so I'll just do that. That way if I die to the centipede like a fucking idiot. I don't lose, like, an entire skill point. I used to backstab these guys to, um... What do you call? Um... I used to, like, farm for levels. <laughs> I used to backstab them. Uh... Okay. Gonna be interesting. Shit. How did I know this guy was gonna own me? Every single one. God damn it. Do more sweeps, come on. There we go. Okay. Timing down is really easy, actually. Not 
target all. Got it. All right. Two prayer beads in my inventory, huh? I think there's another one like right here. I like coughed midway through saying that word, like kind of. Is this a prayer bead? No. Is it like down this path? That would make sense. I wanted to check behind me, but I was just cycling the camera like a psycho. I think this is just the way to get down here from up there, yeah. Um, I, I do not think that I have time to go and fight the monkey, but I'll, I'll just do like a couple more things. Is this not the way? This is the way. Um, but guardian monkey, guardian ape, uh, guardian monkey, guardian ape is, I guess, the next, um, thing to fight, uh, for me, I think, I think this is the way. That's just confetti. I swear there was a bead in here somewhere. Oh, this is it. Right? Yeah, three beads. I've been poisoned. I feel like there's like an item or two in there that I haven't got yet, but that's fine. Oh, it's this. This was the only thing I haven't got yet. Um, slightly confused. There is bead. Well, I got it. Thank you. For the heads up though, yeah, this was the way back, okay. Camera's being a little funky, that's okay. I forgive it. <laughs> it's always a little weird in these uh, enclosed spaces. Um, back up? Is there no way back up? <laughs> huh? It's this, isn't it? Yes. Okay, very nice. Yeah, but I think that's going to be about all for today, once I can find my way back up above the floorboards. Um, yeah, this was a super productive stream. I, I got a whole bunch of bosses and stuff done, and I had a real good time. Um, but we will uh, cross this bridge next stream. Uh, for now, thank you so much for catching the stream. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs>